What's up guys, today we have something a bit special to you because recently this device just walked into our office and it is the Honor 9 phone from Huawei. So I've actually not seen this phone up front because I've only seen like rendering of it or pictures that other people have taken off the phone so this would be quite exciting to unbox. And of course, my name is Tarvin from KL Gadget TV and let's get to the unboxing of the Honor 9 phone. So here we have the Honor 9 box. Now the box is actually pretty thin. I mean, it's like just this thick and the height is about this much only. So we can see here, let's look around. So basically we've got the glacial gray version of the phone. It comes with uh, 64 gigs of internal storage and four gigs of RAM. Now this is a very interesting packaging because as you can see, it's actually pretty compact and the phone is right here. It just slides out. There we go. All right. So obviously this looks pretty, but before that, before we get to the phone, let's see what else is in the box. Let's pull this out. So as you can see here, they actually told us what is inside the box already. We have the uh, SIM ejector. We have, of course, our manual. We have the charging brick and of course, the USB Type-C cable. So here, let's check what is in here. We have the manual, of course, and of course, we have the SIM tray ejector. So here we have the USB Type-C cable and of course, the charging brick, which does support quick charging and Huawei has actually mentioned that uh, the phone can be charged to 40% in just 30 minutes. So with that, let's get it out of its plastic first. All right. There we go. And now we have the Honor 9 phone from Huawei. And the behind looks very nice. Oh, I really like this. You can actually see that there is light reflections and they actually warp around the phone. So that's very nice, very nice the back. Uh, it's not really um, uh, a mirror. It's a very, a bit opaque. But other than that, I think the behind of the phone looks gorgeous. And on the front, of course, we have the 5.2 inch screen. We have the fingerprint sensor on the side. We have your regular power button, rocker buttons, uh, volume rocker, sorry. And we have the SIM card tray over here. And of course, the USB Type-C. We have the speakers over here the 35 mm jack and on top here what looks like to be an IR blaster so we got to look into the phone and check it out so the lighting effect and the reflections on the back of the phone is actually thanks to the aurora glass that honor has put on the back of the phone so that is why you are getting all these nice little light effects as you move the phone around so with that let's get the phone turned on now i like the ui honestly it's actually pretty simple it is almost like the stock Android when on first glance. So it's actually pretty nice. It's not, it's not so different from the stock interface. Of course, you don't have the um, app drawer, but other than that, all the apps are still on here. So as you can see here, we have the about the phone. And of course, it is running on EMUI 5.1. It has a Kirin 960 processor, which is basically a step down from the newest processor that Huawei has, which is the 970. So other than the processor, the RAM and the storage, the phone actually comes with Android 7.0 out of the box and we are expected to receive the Oreo update soon. So next, let's take a look at the camera or the quality of the camera for that matter. So let's take a picture of our office area. I uh, hope you guys can see this. But I have to say, the color reproduction is actually pretty nice. If you can see our green color mat here, it looks really nice and green. Uh, of course, you can see that uh, Warren has a, a pink color bag that he likes to carry around. And that bag also looks pretty nice. The color is pretty nice. Uh, of course, I think uh, we were definitely going to do much better camera testers with uh, low lights and places that are brightly lit up, of course. So as I mentioned before, there is an IR blaster on the top of the phone. And Honor has included an app for us to take advantage of that IR blaster, which is called the Smart Controller. So in the smart controller, you can choose the type of device that you want. There's of course the TV, air conditioner, set-top box, a camera, and network, STBs, DVD players, projector. So you can choose uh, whatever device that you have at home. Usually for me, it is always my icon and my TV, but might be different from you. So I really enjoy when companies add IR blasters into their phone because I think it adds so much more convenience to the appliances that you have in your house. Because as I mentioned before in one of my previous reviews, our phones are always with us but our remote controls are never with us. So with that, 
I think that the Honor is a very beautiful phone. On my first impressions of the phone, it is a very beautiful phone. I think, the, especially the back, I really love how the back, the design of the back is. Everything is so flushed and nice. And of course, it's a bit of a fingerprint magnet, but it's just a matter of you just cleaning up the thing. Maybe, you know, just use your t-shirt and rub it off. Mo most of us do that anyway. So other than that, I think this is a very gorgeous phone and do expect our review of this phone to come in the next uh, probably two to three weeks time. And with that, I hope you guys subscribe to KL Gadget TV because we do have a lot more videos like this. And of course, check out our, all our videos, follow us on our usual social media platforms. My name is Tarvin and I will see you soon.